Hey, hey, um, hi, ho, I am Igra Glass, and uh, I'll tell you how to play Dungeon Crusher. I play this game more than one month, one month, and I'm not the pro, but I made a lot of progress already, right now at level 2400. I have nice clan, and I've tried all types of game content. So let me share the experience. We will start from basics. I'll choose a basic account, a new one, at other realm. So let's go there. And I'll tell you from the scratch all the basic features of this game. Uh, like in other clicker games, uh, actually this game it's not a clicker. It's kind of strategy RPG idle game. Uh, because you do not need to click much here. You see, you could do it, but uh, let's start from basics about heroes. There are two different, mm, there are lots of heroes, but there is also kind of your main hero. When you just start to play, install this game and you click, there is a, this fist uh, on top of the screen. Right now it's 33 damage I make per click. And it depends on your character. This is your character. It's not a hero. It's not a real hero. And also there are heroes. Uh, heroes who make damage automatically. So when I, for example, level up this hero and half key, I'll hire her. She's not here. You see? And we do not make any damage except clicking. So if I'll hire her, she will automatically uh, damage monsters and she will automatically kill them eventually. Of course, at the beginning you could help her, but actually it's not really obligatory, because soon, uh, like as I showed you um, at my main account, at my main account, in 99% of the time you do not click in this game, so it's not a really clicker game. It's an important aspect. Uh, the main source, the main resource here, it's a gold, uh, which you see every time when you kill a monster, it drop you some uh, gold. Also, it could drop you an item. When you just start, uh, monsters they do not drop item, but soon they will do so. Uh, levels consist uh, of ten scents. So each monster, each level got uh, ten monsters. So right now I'm level eight, for example. We could also uh, level up our hero Ina. Ina, by the way, uh, it's good to know that it's uh, the best hero for the first week of the game. There are some different strategies uh, which hero to take as your main hero. Um, if you played already a while, you will have a lot of heroes. But actually, this game played by main heroes. It's important to concentrate your resources at one hero. So, by the way, Ina is one of the best uh, starter heroes because she got AoE ability, very powerful one, and she is an elf, she will have a lot of bonuses in different uh, game uh, mods, in different uh, mini games, um, in PvP, so this is very good hero actually, so uh, I recommend for everyone to focus at her at first. So. Uh, when you just start, you you do not have much options. You just need to uh, level up your um, your heroes, which you possess, as much as you go, go as you could uh, till some time. Uh, sometimes you will meet uh, bosses which have uh, a bit more health, uh, but it, at the beginning. Uh, it's not really a big problem. You see that they also attack you. So this green thing, it's how much damage they make to your hero. And if uh, this green small line will go faster than you will kill it, you would uh, reset it. You wouldn't uh, pass this level. And you will have uh, the button on top of the screen beat the boss. So you could try again. Uh, so if you're stuck, you could just uh, 
a go back, you could just go back. There is a important button. Uh, there are a lot of buttons and you will have even more buttons soon. Important button uh, to the right bottom of the screen. If you click it, you will see list of the levels which you uh, passed. And you are free to uh, get back to uh, previous level, any previous level. So for example, I could go back here. Uh, this is important um, option. So uh, if you want to go back, it's better to remove it because uh, either way they will go back to the highest content. So I went back and here um, my hero um, quite powerful at these levels. But you don't, do not need to do it uh, much. You if, if you stuck at uh, first boss, you just go to previous level, uh, remove tick of after advance and uh, you will get um, a few gold. You need to uh, get a few gold. So you will uh, kill the boss or you could just click boss through. So yeah, it's uh, quite possible. Just click. Yeah, like this, we made it. And uh, now we could after advance, uh, we could go, we could, uh, don't forget to put this tick by the way here, because sometimes you could stack at one, sta one level and it will be quite stupid. So our goal is just uh, to get past as much levels as we could. Also, there are some additional missions. We will go there soon. But for now, you just uh, get till you hit the wall. The wall, it means that uh, you won't be able to uh, progress. Uh, also, don't forget to take uh, daily bonus. Every day you get some uh, free thing. Uh, at first, it's uh, quite important to get them, but later on, uh, these daily bonuses, they are not too important. So what we have? We have panel of heroes here. And uh, it's our character. It's not a hero, as I said, which, uh, yeah, I didn't say that. Heroes, you see, they have swords. Swords, it means after damage. So they, they, uh, they make DPS. So they um, attack your heroes automatically. And also there is a damage per click, DPC. Uh, which which is this fist? So it's very easy. Fist make sixty eight damage. You could see, and the DPS uh, make uh, one hundred eighty one. So right now when I created two hundreds, so you could see how every second two hundred damage made. So one two hundred damage made, two two hundred damage made. So it's not per tick, but per second. It's important to know. So then we will we have a panel of our character. It's actually the same thing as this one. Uh, but also we have some additional skills, which is useful for PVP. So uh, we will get to it in our next guides. Uh, then we have panel with artifacts. We do not have artifacts yet and we can't buy them because we need souls for, for it. You will get for your souls after level 100. For, for, for now, just uh, you could look at this panel. And also there is achievement bar. It's not uh, really important because eventually you will open them all and they give very small bonuses. It's not really important. Then you have rating. Uh, it's uh, cleanse. Uh, we will talk about cleanse a bit later. Uh, it's obligatory obligatory to join clan and it's possible to choose the best clan which will uh, give you huge bonuses. I'll show you how to do it. And yeah, your profile. So it's just your achievements. So let, let's, uh, for now, you do not need to buy anything. Uh, there is a possibility, the only important for now, quick boost. So you will pass four hours time if you watch an ad or or pay some bottles. Do not spend bottles at first. Just forget about bottles for now. Uh, you need uh, just advance. Uh, you, do, you do not need really um, spend anything. It's important. Also, there is a treasure cave. We already opened it. And uh, here we could uh, get, by the way, let's level up. Level up our damage. Uh, here you will get some treasure. Uh, you will find such caves only at the beginning of the game. Later on, uh, you wouldn't uh, have them. 
The good thing about this case that uh, you receive plenty of gold, so you could level up your hero. Uh, you should try to level up your hero uh, as often as much more often than clicking hero because it's kind of the most modern thing. And in this uh, cave, we received an artifact. It's our first artifact. You could find it in the artifact panel. It increases our click damage for eight, 150. It's kind of nothing. So at the beginning of the game, this uh, artifact could um, look nice, but later on, it's just nonsense. It's nothing. Uh, so uh, you will meet during the game on the game map. You will meet some uh, special places, places of the of interest, and you need to went there manually. So automatically you will go through regular levels, but manually you should go uh, to these uh, special points of interest. And also there are additional missions, we, yeah, we, we will go to them, there are mines uh, which will open later on where we will get some uh, gems. And also high-end thing, it's a castle which is only like you will get there after a few months of playing, so just forget about it for now. Uh, also, there is a chat in the game where you could ask some uh, stuff when you reach level 80. To, so, I recommend you to join Discord. Um, Dungeon Crusher got, got very good Discord channel where people will help you and give you a lot of advice. So, just Google uh, Discord and Dungeon Crusher Discord, you will find a lot of stuff here. Okay, we got new hero, new hero and uh, important thing about heroes, basic th thing, that uh, each hero has parameters like class, ra uh, race, um, like strength, uh, heal, health, attack, defense. But all these parameters you do not need to bother about them. Just forget about them and this attack skill because they work only in special stuff in PvP. Uh, when you fight for mines or in sieges or in leagues so or in dragon draft it's new uh, mod you don't just forget about it for now the most important for you it's skills so each hero got skills which um, like passive passive skills which will uh, influence during the main phase when you fight here when you advance uh, through the game, through these levels on the map. Yeah, let's go back. We do not need, um, do not need it, yeah. When you advance from the, uh, through the map, the only things which uh, influence on your character, it's his level, your level, uh, character, level, level of your character. For example, right now it's 21. It's uh, his equipment, which is, mm, shouldn't interest you for the first uh, like 400 levels so just forget about it and skills yeah skills so when i'll get level 25 for example i'll receive additional uh, hero damage 100 percent so it's definitely a good idea to get level 25 you see and it, it's appeared here so new icon appeared so uh, next level up Next ability will be at uh, level 50. So you could uh, try to get level 50. Or right now I think, uh, yeah, it's still better to level up this hero because if we will, uh, level, if we will level up uh, this one, uh, you will receive only 260 uh, DPS for 4,000 gold. Uh, you see? So... And here we have uh, less cost and uh, very nice uh, gain. Let, let's kill. Uh, sometimes you will see such chests. They give additional gold. Uh, 700. You see here, here you receive a bit uh, more for now. So we, we could go a bit further on. Uh, some heroes, they are buffers. They could make buffs, for example, Garrick. Later on, you will know all these heroes. You will know all their parameters, all their abilities, and they will make a lot of sense. It's very important. So it's one of the most interesting parts of this game. It's actually learning heroes and their abilities because uh, uh, you will uh, play a lot. Let me just show it. Yeah, 
the game it will play by itself. You could just close it, closed uh, at your phone, for example, go to do something, and you will return back and you will see that you uh, you advanced. So let's remember right now. Ah, let's beat the boss. We you see <laughs> uh, when you fail to beat the boss, this tick uh, will be removed. Ah. Oh, it won't. I think yes, it won't. But you just need to click the button. So let's kill the boss, and we will see which level we will advance. Yeah, let's finish it. Yeah, we got ten thousand gold. Uh, yeah. By the way, there are soon will be a mission. You see, uh, episodes. Yeah, it's additional mission uh, with some uh, lore behind it. The thing is that you. Uh, your uh, skill doesn't work there, your regular skill. Uh, you need, later on you will find artifact, I think, which will uh, go through it. But you just could uh, go there sooner. Do, do not go there right now. Uh, just uh, continue through le regular levels because uh, you could choose to go there or go regular level so for now it's just forget about it and go regulars so let's level up a bit and let's take a note right now i'm at uh, level 16 16 and now let me log in to my main account just to, to demonstrate the game how it looks like uh, at high levels you see this little uh, arrow you push it and you could change realms. Let's go to main account and I'll show you how heroes could be used. So, uh, you see, I, I got lots of heroes. They all uh, leveled up, I think. Except this one. Yeah, I, I want to use him for next uh, part of the guide. So, lots of uh, monsters, uh, lots of heroes. They got each got different abilities, different skills, and how we could use them, just a demonstration. Uh, for example, you could go to fight Siege, to go to fight Siege, to fight with uh, terrifying monsters. Uh, let me check down new one, just to show you. So each hero, here all hero powers works in this mod, for example. You do not need to watch it, uh, from the start, uh, you, you could just you see uh, they got a real fight in these sieges, and you got uh, different types of resources for it. There are rating competition between players, even PvP. So it's quite fun. You see, I destroyed this boss. So also there are leaks, P PvP leaks, uh, which is basically similar uh, battle like a siege, um, and there are. Dragon Draft, which is one of the most complex uh, after battlers around. And uh, here also it's impo super important to know all parameters of your heroes and their uh, bonuses. So each parameter, parameter is important, but um, it's important not for beginning. So when you just start to play, let's back, go back to our first server. When you just start to play, do not care about it. You see, and we uh, at level 18 still, yeah. Okay. But when you, oh, by the way, they make some promotions. It's uh, the best way, the best uh, thing, if you wish to support developers, this game is totally free to play game. And I played for a month with nice progress without uh, spending a dime. But if you wish to support devs, um, this one, uh, it's not the best deal, I think. So the best thing way it's uh, to buy the special thing. Later on, it will open to buy guns, to buy guns because for it you will get dem demon horns, and it's the thing which will uh, give you immense, um, immense rewards uh, you will be able to trade you see all trading in this game it's going for demon horns its main um, currency it's the most Im important uh, items but you will uh, have to care about it at after 2000 levels so for now just forget about it 
so you could um, just get into the game to understand what's going on okay we have plenty of gold we could already let's uh, by the way you could uh, use uh, different types of upgrading and i recommend you to use max actually it's the most easy uh, way to upgrade your heroes just use max yeah and go forward <laughs> let's uh, let me just uh, stop recording and we'll back when we will advance a bit also important thing uh, your main hero uh, opening his after level 50 i think yeah uh, it's got a first skill skill which automatically perform 10 taps per second which is a lot uh, so it's uh, definitely cost to use it sometimes so you use the skill there are different types of skills i'll tell you about them most time you use the skills for uh, pvp so there is a pvp mod and you use the skills to win in pvp because without the skills it's not possible so it's kind of main their purpose and also these two skills uh, you use them for uh, midas jump through a special portal to get to higher levels after you reset your progress we will talk about it later too so for now you just uh, from time to time once per 10 minutes you could use it and level up continue your continue leveling your heroes as i said uh, if you stuck and boss kill you uh, you could just uh, you you just play for previous level and you uh, get a few stuff you see and uh, after advance removed after advance stick so you do not you you just need to if you do not want to spend time on this boss you could just manually move uh, through game map so it's important thing because a lot of people even at the at um, who play like month or so they forgot about the thing that they could move around the map so you could visit any level so some people for example they afraid to level up artifacts like special portal uh, because they wouldn't be able to collect uh, low level resources but actually you could uh, you just move manually and remove tick after advance yeah so if you stuck somewhere just go lower a bit and uh, wait some time also you could do this trick uh, let's get level mm. when you just start it's all right uh, you do not have daily quests for now ah oh you already have oh beautiful okay I, so I i just forgot when i started you have quests and this is super important thing because these quests it's uh, the main source of bottles these bottles uh, which is the main currency actually in su super important thing you see we uh, uh, new heroes they will open af after you visit certain uh, depth certain levels so at level 19 you see we have um, already several heroes uh, so the thing is that you could uh, make some actions for example defeat daily boss which is not open for now it's super important thing about daily boss i'll explain it uh, in i think second part of the guide but uh, guide by for now uh, just uh, go to the quests and check if you have this one uh, because it's kind of super important thing time travel tt it called uh, when you will use it the game will go forward for four hours so first before you will do it level up your heroes uh, yeah, do not level up your main hero it's useless because uh, clicking damage wouldn't work in time travel time travel works only uh, damage from your heroes this one also remove this tick uh, I, th I think it wouldn't work even if, if it will be there uh, but let, let's even try try and let's watch and push watch add uh, so i made time travel and you see after four hours after four hours we collected 17 millions because k it means like kilo like million so it's 70 millions gold we collected and we still at 
20 level because we need to upgrade our heroes. So we, we killed a lot of monsters at the same previous level for a lo for long time. But now we could uh, level up, we could hire new heroes and upgrade them. Uh, I think uh, this one got nice DPS, so just go through it. It's nice to open additional skills. And this is the way if you stuck you also could do it. And the good thing that you wouldn't spend your, your potions with this quest. So you could get uh, potions back even with some more. Uh, because time travel costs 10 potions and for this quest when you complete it you receive 20. Sometimes you will meet uh, quests to complete 5 time travels in a row. So the basic rule do not do time travels uh, if you do not have the quest yet because quests they resetting every eight hours and if you will complete all the quests you will be able to make uh, a reset immediately so if we will right now do all this stuff we will pay 10 potions and all quests will be reset which is very good thing it's the best way to spend your potions by resetting the quest but it's some some quests they are quite hard to um, complete so uh, let's uh, upgrade stuff actually when you just uh, start uh, the game it doesn't really matter where uh, where to spend uh, gold which you have no it's better to choose kind of like your main hero, your main three heroes, where to spend resources. Uh, but uh, not not at the uh, immediate way. It's important to do when we will start to do daily boss, which we will soon start. It's not uh, this one. It's just regular boss. Yeah, so uh, later on I'll tell you. Uh, eventually you will meet frost monsters. And that's frost and that's which is uh, you wouldn't be able to kill them with your uh, regular hero damage. So you, you need to find special artifact to fight fire X. Uh, to find it, as I showed you at the beginning, we need to go to this curse of Hadur. So uh, here you see right now it's much easier to go. We could also use this skill. And yes, after advance, click after advance. So at the end of this dungeon, you will find a special X, which fill you with the power of fire. Special artifact, and it will help us also in main mission. So at this point, at level 31, you, you should go there. Oh, we found some forgotten supplies, beautiful. And some storyline here, you could uh, read it to get some um, information about the lore so you see we are not uh, here but we right now here in this uh, story you see it consists of several paths several parts so we are going through it you need to click it's kind of the only uh, place in game where you need to click later on you wouldn't need it except special levels 666 so at 666 level you there will be fire level where you will need also elemental damage and there is no ice elemental damage there are only fire so you need um yeah cool We're going through the, the story so at level 66 or 166 or one um so any, any level where we meet 666 will have fire hell level which you need to click through but it's very rare so in most cases you wouldn't meet it uh, while well, you go through this level it's good idea to upgrade um, your hero a bit yeah so just after some time you will uh, uh, you will find some special stuff which will start working but it's not the fire X yet, so but still it will be a bit easier here. So at a certain moment, your heroes will start uh, work. 
Yeah, you see, in this uh, storyline mission, you will receive this hero, which got some uh, fire damage, at least. Um, so, you see, it's this small drop, fire drop. So, you have now not simple sword, like the regular missions, but sword with fire drop, uh, which you use, use it. But it's not uh, the artifact yet, so we're still going, we're still progressing. Where are we? Yeah, you see, it's just uh, half of the curse mission. At the same time, our uh, dwarf friend will find his armor. You see, so it's kind of we, we uh, mm, the story. It's about him, your dwarf friend, getting uh, full equipment in Hadur. So, yeah, it's fun. So eventually, we found Fire X. Yes, and this is the most important thing at the beginning of the game because it will give you possibility to go through uh, through main missions because it give you if it give you possibility to fight uh, you could actually finish uh, these missions but also uh, if we will go back to main mission through uh, the map you will see that finally with this artifact you could uh, continue but le let's uh, yeah let's uh, it's a good thing to finish uh, storyline it's quite rare thing i mean only at the beginning of the game you have storyline and after that you wouldn't have it and at the end you will get an artifact uh, compass uh, so this artifacts it's not a real artifact i mean um the real artifacts you have to buy you have to buy and yeah i'll tell about them in next videos so for, for now we just uh continue we're going we can we, feel we completed our first uh mission then you will be able to go to the next one but for now you just uh go forward forward also uh you see we will we're meeting this point of interest so you could uh, join them you could get there for example this little demons demon links they have they give you uh, potions some potions very nice thing you will meet such demons uh, up from time to time up to level 1100 so if you can't de de destroy it just forget about it and go to regular missions with your um, uh, game game world map yeah, just uh, go and level up further. F further. Uh, the thing is, it's not doesn't really matter to go um, to level up heroes up to this additional bonus. Starting 200 level, hero gets 4x DPS because it's small bonus. So the best way for you is to get till uh, yeah, I I misclicked. It's all right uh, to 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 get uh, till. Uh, main hero bonuses will end so till this one for example so this 200 and 999 you do not do not level up them just level up other heroes if you finished uh, this one because it gives you a good good bonuses and further on it's not really you will do it eventually uh, when you open all heroes and you will have main one but f for now just uh, do it like this you see we're already level 40 actually uh, uh, if you do everything right you could even do it uh, faster so let, let's do it and don't forget to get a reward click on the chest here in daily quest and you will get rewards so there are four tiers of rewards daily and uh, it will be nice to have them all but in most cases I got uh, two tiers or uh, three tiers so two tiers it's must have always but some quests they're hard to, to make okay we will see, say, tell about it later on so now let's uh, concentrate on leveling up our heroes and progress uh, by the way here you could uh, change this thing later on you will yeah uh, we could now go to the next episode already uh, you see uh, 
story with elves. It's better to go through it because it gives you additional nice artifacts. But uh, what I wanted to show, let's go to main missions for now. You could do it later on any anytime. That uh, later on you will use mostly max thing to max your heroes. But for now, very good thing it's to use next. Because next will uh, level up your heroes up to next tier. Next tier, like this one, like to 75. If I'll push next, we will get to 75. Chpik, you see? Uh, this is very nice. At the beginning, you uh, should use it. Uh, but also, if you wish to level, sometimes, yeah, it's better to level up one by one. It's at the moment when you stuck. Uh, because, yeah, that, that's where you will uh, get uh, more DPS. So you always uh, should watch how much uh, DPS per money uh, you got. So not only skills which you accessible, which give, uh, give you um, some bonuses. So DPS, it's the most important thing, turns per second. You see here, it's already uh, doesn't matter really, um, clicking doesn't really matter at this level, even at level 50. So you just level up and go further. You see, we have uh, event tab opened, and this is uh, kind of the first thing, thing where you could uh, take a look at uh, competition with other players. For example, right now I'm at 5,575 plays with 52 uh, points. What is this points? You could always push rules. So this is fire points. You just get through levels and you get points. Very simple thing. And at the end, uh, there will be rewards for all people who participated. And even if you are a new player, you also will receive uh, some nice rewards. Uh, you will receive it through your mail system. So yeah, here. Yeah. You will have it. Uh, yeah, but for now, just don't care about any events, all this stuff. Just uh, as, uh, try uh, get as high as you could and level up all uh, possible stuff. And also, you see, we have uh, some more skills. When you open certain heroes, uh, at certain moment, they have skills. For example, King Midas, it's one of the most important heroes for experienced players because uh, he give you possibility to um, to use hand of midas skill for 30 second each uh, time when you click you will receive a lot of gold so this is very cool thing so yeah don't forget to to check skill stop when you open new heroes and level up them at this point, for example, uh, for me, it's uh, much better to level up not uh, these heroes till high levels, um, but uh, these ones, because they one level up gives lots of DPS. Uh, also, there are nice uh, quest available right now. This one: buy a hero shards pack for magic bottles. If you will push uh, this question mark, you will get immediately to the shop. But you could get them manually also, push, push here, and this is the shop. So we, the quest is to buy pack of shards. You could buy, uh, it costs 40 potions, you already have uh, 200 from the start, you will have uh, some. So you could s safely buy it, spend it, because you will get it back through the quest. So you just pushed this button, you bought it, and now you could open them. Just uh, push this button, open all packs, it will be faster. And you have two shards. Uh, the thing is that these shards, they, uh, you need a lot of them to uh, activate this hero. But eventually you will get all these heroes, all these shards. It's not, e not hard to get them. Uh, most of uh, heroes you will collect ex even from um, cache of shards, which bought for these green games. Uh, you will do it because of the clan you will join good clan and you will have uh, a lot of stuff from it stuff from it but for now just uh, yeah just complete the quest try to complete old quest all quests and yeah you see we've got back these potions yeah uh, eventually you could uh, consider to go to second mission to get an artifact to kick the queen's path 
uh, yeah, the farther we, the later you go, the easier it will be. You see, right now we're just ki killing it with automatically with one uh, blow. So yeah, it's definitely a good time to get through it and get our artifacts. Uh, oops, yeah, uh, here it seems we need to advance uh, this mission. You see, it was um, you need to complete it at certain time. Uh, you need to complete it certain time, so it's better for you to get through mish through main map first, a bit farther, and then it will be uh, much easier. So ju just uh, get through main main stuff, uh, level up your heroes. If you stuck, you could just uh, pass time for four hours. Let's do it. Yeah, and we got plenty of gold. Nice. Uh, let's level up and yes uh, that's it we uh, got very important hero here this one breath so soon uh, i'll show you dark ritual dark ritual it's essential thing about this game yeah but first uh, let's uh, finish this uh, dude you see uh, you could not only uh, you could not only use Let's do it like this. Uh, you would not only use this passing time ability, but you could just turn off the game and it will, as I said, it will play while you offline. So it's a really nice thing. Also, we could visit points of interest to get some gold there. Yeah, this one, for example. Ah, no, it's, it's mines. Mine, mines. I'll show you mines a bit later. Yes, treasure cave. Let's go to treasure cave and uh, get there some gold. Ah, now we have an artifact here. So it's simple enough. Just uh, get through all, all um, these small missions, which you see at the map. You could uh, go through it with this little uh, uh, triangles. Well, you have a lot of them, these triangles red triangles, these arrows, they will help you. So just uh, go through it and uh, collect all artifacts, all gold stuff, which you will get there. Yeah, you see here we got uh, a new artifact. So all these caves, uh, should you should visit them. And if you stuck again uh, at some levels where, uh, yeah, it's all right. So. The main rule is uh, that each battle should be faster than five seconds. So one, two, three. So if for, for five seconds you didn't kill the monster, it means that uh, it's better to make... Yeah, you see, we, fa we started to find our first items. Yes. Um, to take them. So sometimes you kill monster and it drops a bag. Uh, you will see it in a second. Come on, drop me some bags. Yes, you see, uh, and you will get uh, useful items. You will uh, use these items for crafting. You could find them. Uh, there is a list of your heroes and in the list of your heroes. Uh, you uh, go to to the bottom, you see items and here you will find your items. It stores all kinds of items. So uh, shards to create heroes. Uh, consumables, currencies, and crafting stuff. Uh, but the thing is that you do not need to craft anything until you will uh, get 1500 level. Just forget about crafting for now and do it only at 1500 level. You could start it. For now, you could. You will sometimes have a uh, skill. Yeah, it's not, not this one, uh, to, to craft an item. And if you will have this skill, just uh, uh, craft something like magical bottles. I'll share these re recipes with you. I'll make a video about crafting, separate video about crafting. So I'll tell you what to do. Um, but in general, yeah, just don't spend these resources because you will need them later on, later on. So for now, let's just move on. We need to get to level 100. Why, why, why level 100? Because there we will find our first Spectre. Yes, 
But uh, for now, we you just level up, you continue level up your heroes. Just level up them and uh, getting over. So if you if you met level which is very hard for you and you kind of stuck, just use the map and go back. Go back and remove this tick. And then it, you will uh, collect enough gold to upgrade your heroes. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, don't, don't rush too much. <laughs> and uh, after what, don't forget to put this tick back. So you will uh, continue. But actually this is nice speed, it's alright. One, two, you see two and a half seconds to kill monster, it's alright. If it's more than... Uh, um, if it's more than five seconds, yeah, you are in trouble, you need to reset. And I'll show you uh, the reset. It's made with Breath the Merciless, yeah, so soon. Um, in my next video I'll show you, but for now let's just uh, continue. So the moment you could start to use max uh, filter just to level up uh, max low level heroes which you forgot to level up just uh, to make them a bit more powerful because it will be very cheap. But of course your main DPS will be uh, from your um, latest heroes. So yeah. By the way it could be a good uh, time, you see we have a lot of money to get to finish this mission, to spend 245 billion, it's actually nothing for us because we have Q already. By the way, a uh, very important thing to do, uh, it's to, you see here we need uh, to, to pass this le level fa fast enough. Uh, use scientific notation. This Q, it doesn't really uh, tell you much, it's very hard to play with it. Go to the options. Uh, here, yeah. By the way, um, yeah, we need to to finish it. You see, they uh, my heroes they do not attack in this forest. Yeah, so we're going through it. Now it's uh, fighting, and uh, go to to options. Uh, right, um, this thing then gear. In this gear turn uh, scientific notation off, on. Then you will have very simple thing here. It wouldn't be like A, B, C, D, um, not really understandable thing, but it will be much easier. You will have just great. You will just have great. Oh, we have a new hero by the way. We passed the cave. Uh, so considering a notation 18 uh, 8 grade, it means that you just uh, take 1.6 and add, it, add 18 zeros to it. So it's kind of huge number. And it's very easy to uh, look at it, into it because yeah, it's just you count these zeros and that's it. Yeah. And uh, you continue leveling and getting on till level 100. By the way, uh, after completing this mission, you wouldn't have any more. Because this uh, third one, I think it's not here yet. Uh, at certain moment, it could be start hard, starting hard for you, so you could use these skills. For example, I used this uh, glove. Every click, give me additional gold. And with this glove, uh, click the boss or chest, it's the best thing. Uh, and yes, it will give you possibility to get a new uh, hero and make more damage. So, everyone, this way you just level up till level 100, uh, level 100 and level up all your heroes and then you watch my next video. Because my next video I'll tell you about Dark Altar, Dark Ritual, Dark Ritual, no, uh, Altar, we also have art Altar. Yeah, but uh, I'll tell you about it a bit later, but for now, next video will be about Dark Ritual. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more guides, more interesting videos. See you! Oh! Uh, also very important thing, almost forgot it, uh, daily boss. It's the most critical thing to do it every 24 hours. 
The thing is that there is a trick which gives you possibility to uh, kill daily boss and upgrade rarity of precise hero which you need. And as I said at the beginning of this video, your main hero should be Ina for the beginning. The thing is that to do it precisely, you first need to make dark ritual. Uh, so it's kind of advanced technology, which I'll show in my next uh, one of my next guides. But for now, if you just started and um, you, you could do it. If you didn't get to dark ritual yet, uh, you could uh, and you are going to sleep this uh, 20 th this day today then it's better to to go daily boss just watch that you should have here 99 percent chance of success you could kill it and you get rarity of could uh, get rarity of some random hero from your list but later on do not do it just uh, randomly do it after watching my guide how i'll show you to do it right so for this time for today you could do it if you wouldn't see my next video you could uh, Kill daily boss. Have a good day. Bye bye.